try another variation of a Kate McLaren. This time it's a Kate McLaren Hopper. So I've got a size 8. This is a vintage Mustad in here. Don't um, worry about that. Any sort of size 8 hook will do. And we're going to choose topping for the tail. That's relatively flat. I said before, I don't really like the really curved ones. I think it's sort of unnatural. So, we take our tying thread down towards the level with the point of the hook. And apply the top one. And I've wound that little bit down over the the bend to account for the the curvature of the of the topping. So essentially, we'll end up with kind of a, a level plane topping. So now we'll add a silver oval as our rib. And I'm going to tie this on underneath and slightly towards the far side. Of the fly. The body is black seal. So we'll take our seal and spread it down the tie and thread and start to wind. What I want to do is get one fibre trapped or two fibres trapped, and that will then allow me to wind up the, the dubbin cord. Nice and tight. And then, sorry, it's just slipped on there. I can get a nice even body, hopefully. No. I'm going to palmer this fly with a black cock hackle. So, just going to strip that off. Well, if you've noticed I've stripped off a little bit of the leading edge there, and that should, when I wrap it, stop any fibers sort of going out of position on that first turn. that on. The second turn in directly behind it. And then we'll start to wrap backwards two, three, four, five turns. And up underneath, take our tying, our uh, silver oval, and then I'm just going to wiggle it through so as not to trap any fibres if I can. And here I'm aiming for five turns on the body, tying in as the sixth one comes round. Take our palmered hackle and just press it back. This fiber here is sticking out, so I'll get rid of it. So, this is a hopper. So, what I'm going to do is take some of these pre knotted. Legs from Denyard, I think. 
I'm going to take three of those, put them all on this side. Don't like the way they're sitting. Try them on the other side, see if they look better. Yep. And then I'll take three from the far side. And tie them on my side. Same length. <coughs> now I'm going to take a Red game hand hackle. And strip off the fluff. I'll double the hackle over. Take out the tip. A couple of fibers and tie in on that last, very last millimetre or so of the uh, the stock and fold it back and we get our hackle pliers and then wrap on a few turns Red game hen. Pull that through the fibers so as not to drop any down. Now I'm going to create hopefully a neat little head. And I'm just going to run about one inch of the thread with super glue there. And finish that off. couple of half hitches now to finish that we'll take our clear varnish Up the head, and if we take a hackle, then strip the base of it, leave some fibers at the point of it, and we can slide that up through to make sure that the eye is clear, and that 
Here's our Cape McLaren hopper. 